to a CBS 4 News Health Alert and important information for women. For the first time in 12 years, the American Cancer Society has updated its guidelines for when women should get mammograms. Here's a look at the new recommendations. Sherry Forrest had her first mammogram at age 35 after she felt a lump in her breast. Luckily, it was a false alarm. I've gone every year since. The American Cancer Society is now recommending women at average risk have yearly mammograms starting at age 45, not 40. Study author Dr. Kevin Offinger says the benefits far outweigh the harm starting at 45. Between 40 and 44, breast cancer is less common. Uh, there is still the risk for a false positive, and so we thought that that needs to be an informed, shared decision between the woman and her health care provider. Starting at 55, the American Cancer Society recommends screenings every two years. That's closer to the U.S. Preventive Task Force guidelines, which recommend mammograms every two years starting at age 50. Some doctors say the guidelines are confusing and only take into account breast cancer deaths and not quality of life for survivors. The chief of breast screening at Lenox Hill Hospital recommends all women start yearly mammograms at age 40. Women who develop breast cancer and their you know, 40s, early 40s develop a very aggressive breast cancer and it spreads rapidly. Forrest says she's had a few false positives in her early mammograms. It's scary when you're waiting to find out results. But she says she'd rather have the screenings than cancer. The new guidelines from the American Cancer Society also get rid of the annual clinical breast exam by a doctor.